the nights, let me share with you one of the joys of being up late. It's like 2.30ish in the morning. The elevators in the middle of the night are at your beck and call. So I press that button, and here it comes. I could have probably done with the other elevator, but this one's actually closer now that I look. Um, so I'm up in the middle of the night. I'm tired as hell, but I can't sleep. So I'm gonna go do what I do best, eat. Hopefully when I get my belly full, um, I'll be a little bit, it'll be a little easier to fall asleep. Sometimes that works, sometimes it backfires on me. Um, there's a, there's a place around here, it's a buffet restaurant. It's open 24 seven. And after midnight, they have a special where for $4 you get into the buffet. Um, it's mainly probably something that only drunks take care of or take advantage of. Or maybe just, you know, people like me who can't sleep. I've never been there this late at night. It's that something fishy place. I've been there twice now, and I think I've actually included you both times to some extent or another. Um, but I am curious after hours, like after like during the cheap buffet, if they have the same spread or whether it's like limited or, or what the deal is. But uh, yeah, we're gonna go and we're gonna try to find that out. All right, next clip. And tonight, I believe it worked. I went out, I ate, nothing super awesome happened. I was surprised by the, uh, the variety that they had, especially the different variety from what I've seen before. Um, <clears throat> so good on you there, something fishy. Um, it was a little bit more limited than it is for their dinner rush, understandably so. I mean, the place didn't have a whole heck of a lot of people in there, but it had, it had enough. It had some people. This is weird because I could see myself. This camera has a, um, a rear-facing viewfinder, so being able to see myself in the reflection, I don't know if, there, if you guys can see the infinity mirror effect or something, I don't know. But, um, Kind of weird. Anyways, so now I'm headed back up to George's floor. Um, I'm gonna go to the green room, grab my laptop, try to crash. Tomorrow is a big day because tomorrow I go to the uh, I go to immigration again. I can't believe it's been a month since the last time that I was there. Hopefully this time I can get a visa to stay six months, and then uh, and who knows what happens after that? I don't know. But um, so yeah. Next clip.